Well, new at six, Leon County is taking on lobbying and funding for the Promise Zone project at their commission meeting tonight. Commissioners are looking into an ordinance to beef up the definition of lobbying. The Promise Zone funding targets high poverty areas under the County Community Human Services Partnership. ABC 27's Christian Thomas is live from Leon County Courthouse. Christian, what did they decide on about these issues? Well, the county moved to approve an ordinance to specify what the definition of lobbyist is that both lobbyists and elected leaders will be able to understand. Now, the goal today was to specify certain policies lobbyists would need to follow the, to follow, excuse me, to be registered with the county. Commissioner Rick Miner headed this up and wanted to clear up uncertainties with lobbying. We want to make sure that if someone is lobbying the county commissioners or county employees, that it's listed for the public to be able to see. <laughs> Commissioners have also approved the increase in funding for Promise Zone. That means now certain services can apply to be a part of the program, such as youth services and job training. Commissioners want to make sure incoming organizations will not be taking on the same issues that other agencies in those communities are targeting. Being addressed by the um, agencies already, and that we may be able to assess that impact um, or incentivize it. In The Promise Zone only funds projects and organizations that provide human services. Now, commissioners also discuss more funding for the Kearney Center. They are also a part of the Promise Zone and serve poverty-stricken areas. Now, the lobbying ordinance will be taken up at next, uh, next commission meeting where they'll be able to provide further movement on what they're going to do next when it comes to the ordinance being implemented. Live in Tallahassee, Christian Thomas, ABC 27. All right, thank you, Christian.